There's a link to our link tree. So on the link tree, um, everything's in there. Thank you for the follow, Happy Jacks. Thank you. I'll follow everyone back afterwards. I'll follow today. Appreciate it. Just trying to get our numbers up on Facebook. On um, and on what what uh, <laughs> I forgot what I'm on. Thank you, Happy Jacks. Uh, so far, we've um, given out over 50,000 pet meals across the UK so far. That's just over 18 months. I know, it, it's a huge amount. And the, the uh, yesterday I was reading my local um, rescue. Uh, they've had to close their doors. Um, they've got uh, their full to the brim. And, and then another one locally in Gloucester. Uh, yesterday I was told about and they've had to do the same so pets are just um, you make your own pet food for your dog oh excellent it's very good uh, you can do if you look around it, it can be quite cheap but again we also know that um, we all get we all struggle at times you, do you know what I mean I know I have I've struggled uh, in the past at the moment I'm okay but um, there's a group of us we've got uh, the observer but there, we've we've got a team of over 80 volunteers right across the country so um we should be able to reach you sorry i'm just uh hit my my finger and uh, made it bleed a little bit thank you happy jacks um thank you so yeah we couldn't do it without the volunteers. I say we've got about 90 across the country so far. Uh, we're always looking for volunteers wherever you are in the country if you, you'd like to help. Getting food to uh, people and making sure pets stay in their homes. We certainly do Happy Jacks. Again, at the top up here, if you go on our page, there's a um, link tree. If you go, if you hit that, it take you to all the different links that you need that that uh, we do. So, whether it's to donate, whether it's to volunteer, or whether you actually need help, hit there, and it'll take you to all the right places you need to go to get help. Or you can call us, you can email us. Uh, anyway, that's easy to you. Um, it is a self referral. Um, so you don't need anything special you just need to be in hardship at the moment it doesn't matter if you're disabled whether you're on benefits people in work are struggling at the moment as well you know so we've been running we started the group we started a facebook group in december of 22. um it took um took off straight away to be honest thank you Samantha for the follow truly appreciated it all took off straight away immediately we'd already seen that there you know people at food banks were saying they can't get pet foods obviously they're struggling in the first place to you know go into a pet food bank so um, we started going and it's just built and built our Facebook groups got over 4,000 um, we then applied for charity status um, only about three months ago and we just we just um, have received our charity status two, two, two weeks ago so if you want to check us out on the charity commission our number is 208 no it's not <laughs> I've got to think now. <laughs> I've forgotten what it is, but it's, it's in the link up there. I was, I was, I wouldn't know it. What animals do we f collect food for? Any pet, so anything that's a pet. Thank you for the follow, um, Claire. Truly appreciated. So, um, you know, cats, dogs, rabbits, gerbils, ferrets, snakes, tortoises. Um, you name it, we've helped all types, from reptiles to snakes to, so yeah, we then just go around, we, we, we get support, lovely, wonderful support from Blue Cross, we get support from RSPCA, we get um, help, uh, we work with a couple of uh, dog rescues that they help us, we help them, 
Um, we've also got loads of food in from uh, pet food manufacturers, so butchers, direct centres of pallet out, Wainwrights are set as a pallet out. Pets at home, we work with them as well. Um, and also Jollies, food store, uh, pet foods. So we've got quite a good backup. We just started applying for a few grants now so is that we can expand a bit. What we do get very, I know, that's not the first time someone said that, the treasurer. <laughs> the treasurer hadn't her. I've been all called all sorts from Gordon Ramsay to uh, goodness knows. <laughs> Be cheeky, an old Gordon Ramsay. I'm not much older. How often do we go live? We try and go live as often as we can. Um, it, it just depends, really. Um, we were on yesterday, we've been on today. We're, we're going to try and come on daily just to try and pick our numbers up and spread the word, get people to spread the word for us and just let people know we exist. As I said, we've got 4,000 people in the Facebook group and everywhere else we've been but it definitely help promote your case. Thank you the Observer. We, that, that really really would be helpful if any of you can. I've given you a, a follow. Thank you. You've got a lot of followers. 17,000. Wow well, I'm looking at your um, profile after as well. But yeah so um, we drove up to Derby a couple of days ago to uh, wonderful, if you see in our videos that I posted, uh, Phoenix um, helped us out quite a bit. Yeah, to share, if, if, thank you very much Claire, it's truly appreciated. If everyone can share, make sure you've hit the follow button, check out our link tree. For on the link tree, you, where the link is on our page up here as well. Um, got all the links whether whether you thank you Margaret for the follow is truly appreciated thank you um, whether you want to donate whether you want to give us a hand there's a volunteers page um, if you need help there's a direct link to the Facebook group or you can give us a call or um, email whichever search our name on Google we should come up on there thank you Fornicus thank you for the follow um, truly appreciated please let all your friends know share the live hit the follow button at the top on there um, there's a bell on there and if you you do the bell you'll see every time we come on live as well Anita's already been on this morning so that's our other co-founder so we're ba our, our main base is in Redditch, which is where Anita, our other co-founder, um, lives. Um, I, I have quite a big base in a few um, people around um, Gloucestershire. Um, but we help anywhere, wherever you are in the country. Ma Mazazu, thank you so much. That's very, very, very kind of you. It truly is. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for joining the team. That's nine of you in the team now, which is amazing. One more to make it ten. <laughs> anything, anything, if you give us any little uh, donations, like here, with the subscribe, or uh, you join the team, or um, you give us a rose or something, all that money is stored. We withdraw it and it all go on food bank uh, to pay for postage, to pay for foods, anything like that. Thank you, thank you for joining the team. That's ten, we got ten now, which is brilliant. Hopefully over the next few days. We need more people like this man on there. Oh, bless you, thank you. There are a few of us. There's a lot of people that do good on this app. I know this app quite inside out. I've been on it for a few years, doing other things and playing around with it and seeing. So I know how it works. I know about all the uh, good people and bad, but then you get good people and bad in life anyway, don't you? And there's nothing we can do about it. Just have to move on if we all do our little bit. Thank you, Ellie. Thank you for the follow. We all do our little bit. Do you know what I mean? It all matters. That's what I say. Whether we feed one animal, one pet, or two, or a hundred. So can I go on your site and send money directly? We, you can. Um, up, up here, if you follow, if you followed us. For you, which you did for Nicus, uh, there's a link tree link. So in that, 
Um, there's a donate, so you can donate many ways. You can donate with our Amazon food bank li uh, food list, wish list. You can donate uh, monetary wise via PayPal. There's a PayPal link to our PayPal account, um, or you can do a direct bank transfer. Um, you can go to one of our places around the country and just d throw some food in one of the boxes. Uh, lots of ways. If anyone, if, if anyone would like to volunteer for us, we're always looking for people across the country as well to, uh, to volunteer. I got my mates keeping me company here. In the back, as you say, the food's gone down. If anyone was on yesterday, my car was overloaded with food. It was absolutely mental. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. <laughs> so, yeah, so I think I've, I think I've sort of gone over most things to, to, to everyone. But, yes, um, if you hit the follow button, give us a follow. Uh, you're in East Yorkshire. Hull. Okay, I don't think... So, so happy Jack, so I'll try and explain how we work then, so we're at Animal Food Bank, so we get people to join the group, welcome to the group Terry, we get people to um, join our Facebook group or send us an email, we then give them a list of criteria, um, and then they fill in a form. Once the film forms fill in, we then thank you very much, observer. Thank you. Um, once they filled in a form, then our, then we go into one of our, tra our private chat groups and well, our volunteer chat group. Try and find a, a um, volunteer in that area, and then we'll deliver the food. If we don't have a volunteer in that area, and there's no other pet food banks in the area, we will then send a postage parcel. So it only costs us £4.79 and we've got lots of food, so it's not a majorly expensive way of doing things. So we just don't want to make sure that everyone in the country is covered. Dogs Trust, um, Blue Cross and a lot of the larger charities do give out pet foods, but unfortunately they never deliver. So where we possibly can, we will deliver. Um, otherwise, we send it DPD uh, to your local shop for you to pick up from there. So we do have a few places. That have, we've got a few bins. If you have a look at the f um, website uh, via the LinkedIn, um, you'll see where those are across the country. Um, but we're always looking for more people who, who's willing to join, volunteer, help out distributing foods, etc. Um, so yes, uh, I hope that explained that. <laughs> this is our t-shirt. This is our t-shirt. Uh, this is our t-shirt. Which we've had uh, designed. It's different on the back. I can show you them later on the back. Um, we've only got six of those done so far, um, as testers really, because we can't really afford much more. Because we'd rather be spending money on foods and getting the foods out to people. <coughs> oh, thank you. Uh, I hope um, it's easy to get around for you. Uh, I built that myself, and it's the <laughs> it's the first time I've ever um, done a built a web page or anything. So it might not be perfect yet, but I'm still working on it. <laughs> if anyone's got any more questions or anything, are you? Well, thank you. That's kind. I tend to do all the social media and website sort of stuff, so. I um, join us up for everything and what have you. We've got one of our trustees is our financial lady, uh, Mel. She does all the financial side of things. Um, 
and then we've got Shahid, who's another trustee. He um, tries looking for all the grants and writes all our policies up and stuff like that. And then Anita and I are the two co-founders and we sort of do everything. <laughs> We're busy from the minute we wake up in the morning until the moment we go to bed at night. It, it's very, very busy. Uh, there's so many people coming in now. Rescues are just overloaded and not coping. So um, we're, it, w what we're hoping we do is try and ease some of the pressures from rescues as well, which is it's a hard job, do you know what I mean? Um, especially at the moment with uh, it being cat season and lots of cats are being born in across the country I've seen hundreds going into rescue which is really quite sad but um, right everyone I'm gonna have to go for now because I need to go and see my mum <laughs> She's 89, so uh, she's just down the road, so I'm going to spend a couple of hours with her now. I'll still be working in the background, but uh, hopefully we might be on live later again. Thank you everyone who's engaged. Thank you everyone who's followed. Uh, remember, our name is Animal Food Bank UK. My name's Robert. I don't know if you can see that. My name's Robert. I'm the, one of the co-founders. Um, and yeah, if everyone can just give us a, a, a promote wherever you live across the country. Right, thank you. Thank you, Observer, for everything. I'll make sure you're in the group uh, in a second. And have a nice day, everyone. Hopefully I'll catch you all later. If not, I'll catch you tomorrow. Take care now. Thank you. Bye.